Hello everyone, welcome to Cornflower Crafts. I have a small haul to share today. And first I went to Hobby Lobby and Handsome said, get a few items that um, make you happy. So I was like, ooh, okay. And I think a lot of you all know, um, my little gnome family here, there's several others who, one is at sitting at the table having tea, and the other one is in the living room by a um, mixed media piece I did. And um, one of them had requested that I get him something special that he's been wanting for Christmas. So I thought I'd better go to Hobby Lobby and see if they still have it. And um, let me look through my goodies here. <laughs> okay. Good. Um, this is the packaging that it was in. Where is it, darling? It was right here when I was putting things up and setting up the table. You don't know? Mm -hmm. He doesn't know. So you couldn't wait until Christmas? Uh-oh, he even saw the price. I will, you know, 99.9% .9 of the time, I won't pay regular price for anything, basically. But if it's something I think is special, um, I will first go to Hobby Lobby because they're the ones that give me so many things that I inspire me to create and that I really want for 75% off, sometimes 90% off. So I will go there first if I need some. Well, let's see. Where would he put them? Probably in the living room. Wait a minute. You all are... Why are you all standing that way? <laughs> I see it. You little rascal. Well, Merry Christmas early. Here's his tools. <laughs> Here's his tool set. Now, young man, I do realize, yes, you're not a young man. You have a snow white beard. I apologize. Gentlemen, I do realize that tools are important because I'm the one, as I've told several of you before, I'm the one that has the heavy duty tools in this house. They're mine. And my son-in-law gave me a really nice set of screwdrivers that um, I use sparingly because I, I don't want to hurt them. <laughs> but they're very nice and very dependable, but still. I do use them for heavy duty stuff though. Um, and so he had requested uh, a tool, uh, a little wooden toolbox to carry his tools in and a new set of tools. So the things you've been making, you, you need new tools. Mm -hmm. Okay. All righty, well, let's put that here. Just <laughs> look at the hammer, <laughs> I mean, how precious is that? And hold on, where are they? <laughs> Check out the pliers, y'all. They work. Oops, see? We work. I just think that's adorable. And it is wooden, for real. I'll put that here, okay? Rascal. And I also found this adorable pie save, a shaker pie save. And how darling is the tin in there that has a little heart pattern and a circle and the little knobs on it. I just think that is precious. Absolutely adorable, and yeah, I don't think I can. Can I take it out easily? I wanted to show, yeah, I can. I want to show you the sides. <laughs> Look. <laughs> Hopefully you can see that, how they've cut out here and here, and oopsie. When you open, uh-oh, we open just one door? No, we don't, we open two. How cute is that? 
Now I might do something with the inside. I might paint it. But how cute is that? I've never owned a real pie safe, but you guys like it? Do you love it? Yeah. And this is the third thing I got, which is the sewing machine. And you know, it looks a lot like the old Singer ones. And I do have one of those. Um, my machine that, you know, the machine goes down. It usually has a place like this that you can put the machine down. And my, um, I have a, a cable that goes right there that um, needs work on. So mine is not working at the moment, but it's a beautiful display, I can tell you that. Oops, okay, let's see what we got, guys. <laughs> this is so cute. <laughs> if y'all are like me, I know Katamia does, and you love miniatures. Um, I don't know, they just make me smile. They make me happy. Well. And then, <laughs> I looked at, they had three of them there. And I looked at all three, boy, is this not only a tight fit, but it is coming out of the side of this bag, and that's okay. And that was in there, we don't need that. We can toss that aside. Well, this is ending up a long one, which was supposed to not be this long. <laughs> we haven't even gotten to Joanne's yet. Yes, we work, see? We move up and down. We have, I don't think this works though, no, that's stationary. But we have a piece of fabric, our thread. Look at the little tiny spools of thread and the scissors. <laughs> and this is a four drawer when mine has six. Okay, let's put that one over here. Oh, okay, cool. The guys are saying it's that sewing machines, um, men have been working on sewing machines for centuries as well. Very good. So all of you all are interested in the sewing machine? Cool. And I got another thing that I found there at um, Hobby Lobby for 74 cents, this craft stencil. How precious is that? I think it looks like it's Pennsylvania Dutch. I think that is a Adorable. Wouldn't that be darling on a journal cover or uh, just a page in a journal or mixed media? I like it. And for 74 cents, I really like it. <laughs> then off to Joann's. I went into Joann's this time because they gave me a 50% off coupon. I ended up leaving without using it because I love their laces. But to me, their laces are so expensive that even at 50% off, <sighs> I still think they're expensive. And if you're like me and you used to get your laces at uh, thrift stores, um, you, might, you might have the same problem I've been having for the past couple of years as the thrift stores, if they get lace, it's gone in an instant, you know? And, um, so that's really, <clears throat> excuse me, that they're really, really hard to come by. So when I walk in though, I'm like, okay, just shop, shop the whole store. You've got time, look around, you get a little exercise in. <laughs> and I don't know if it's still going on. I hope so, especially since, um, you know, Friday's coming up. I'm sh these deals hopefully are still going on. This is a McCall's, McCall's Patterns, and there's a second one, but I didn't write it down, guys. There's two companies that they're doing this with. Um, their patterns are on sale for $1.99. And you know, they have gone cuckoo crazy with the price of patterns. I, I get it, but woo. This is normally $21.95, and I got it for $1.99. And check out, I love the skirt too, don't get me wrong, but this jacket with the puff sleeves and the collar, I just love that jacket. 
and you can see back here. Look at the back of it. Oh, <laughs> look at the skirt. And then, oh, I think it's just gorgeous. And um, their remnants, now I always go and look at their remnants. Whenever I'm in, I go, not straight to the rooms, but I go there every time. A lot of people go with me. And right now, oh, I hope they still are. I hope, I hope. You might want to call your Joann's if you've got one close to you first and see if they're remnants, you know, if you're interested in remnants or patterns and stuff, see if it's still at these prices. Because they can change in a couple of days, can't they? Um, this went from uh, $4.66 to I paid 83 cents for it. And I'm not sure about this marking. I think it's saying it's 24 inches. I'm not sure. But that's a color I work with a lot, and it's cotton, 100% cotton. And then I found this piece, and it's the pretend suede, and it's the color they've got it listed as is rosewood. It is 59 inches wide, so I'm only getting 0 0.639, you know, yards. But it's so wide, and I only paid 57 cents for it, y'all. And it really and truly feels like suede, and I think it looks quite Victorian. Doesn't, wouldn't that look yummy with some cream lace and stuff? Um, I also found they were having a sale on their Park Lane uh, items. You know, they're normally $2.49 a piece, and they were saying buy two, get two free. So this is for an upcoming giveaway, but I'm going to wait on this giveaway and have it probably early spring because a lot of a lot of y'all tell me that these are spring colors. Everybody's um, thinking about Christmas and Christmas colors. Some people are still into fall and fall colors since, you know, Thanksgiving's a couple of days away. But um, I'm going to do this in the future. Um, there are four boxes here, and I can tell you right now they are adorable. Um, these are some gorgeous gorgeous glassine bags. You get five of them. These, I have these as well in my collection. They are a list pad and they are so darling. They are wonderful to include in a journal to either fold it and tuck it into a little tuck spot or what have you or to just place it on the side of the page and stuff. It's a beautiful little pink and white and line, it's adorable. And I've used that as well. And then I found this, which is a little journal. It has 32 blank pages. And I thought, since it's very plain and it's, it's already stitched, it's stitched up, the that's the binding, that um, someone who wants to start in journaling, um, but is a little apprehensive that maybe they could, um, just deck, put in flip outs on this, uh, decorate, even just decorate the front and put it in their purse or to experiment with the pages, you know, inside, like fold one over, add um, some scrapbook paper to it, have a fold out three times, stuff, you know, play around with it like that. But I thought for an upcoming giveaway, I thought that would be fun. And then I hope they still have it. Their scrapbook paper and some of their other paper. They said the sign that they put up there. I always have issues. I'm sorry, but I always have issues with Joanne sales. The sign they had up there was, <clears throat> excuse me, the papers, you know, on that single papers, you know, the whole display of them. They had several signs up and they said you get um, 10 papers for three dollars as long as it's not over 2.99 or 2.59 or two something so i made sure y'all i made sure my 10 were were not that it stayed under that price 
And guess what? I still had to put back two because he said, oh, this is coming up 259 And I said, but it's under, yeah, it was right. It was under that price. It was 299 I said, it's under 299 and that's what the sign says. He said, well, sorry. <laughs> like, no, you can't have them for that. So I was like, well, then I, I don't care for them. Thank you. So everything I'm going to show you, though, was 30 cents. And this is cardstock, and I don't know if it's showing up, but it is glittery, glittery, and it is gorgeous. See, you can see what I'm saying when I tell you I work with that color a lot. <laughs> so I got not one, but two of those at 30 cents a piece. I got not one, but two of these scrapbook papers. Look, how precious, and I know you've seen these. This is American Crafts puts these out. And you've probably seen them for quite some time, but I don't think you can go wrong with tea themed, either for cards or journals or invitations to a tea party. Ugly. And then I got one of these little pink ones with the cherries for whenever I do my recipe book because my recipe book y'all is extremely old and it looks really rough <laughs> and then I got this scrapbook paper which I think is gorgeous for a vintage journal or card with the roses and and all that foliage I just think that's absolutely beautiful stunning and then again all this 30 cents a piece and then i got these guys and i think i've gotten these before to be honest this is cardstock and this is they call the light blue small dot and the dark pink small dot so i also got those as well and i want to thank you all for joining me um, today and i hope you have a wonderful morning afternoon or evening. Bye-bye, everybody. Take good care.